So now I'm going to show you how to draw the Makapu Lighthouse. I'll be using a pen so you can see, but whatever you use when you're starting off, just press softly in softly. case you want to erase or change lines, yeah? All right, here we go. So I'm going to start with a cliff right around here, and right a little flat area where the lighthouse lives, okay? That's where the Makapu Lighthouse is going to sit. And I'm going to put the base of the lighthouse, just a thin little oval where it sits right there, and right here, I'm going to put like the main structure of the lighthouse. And it's going to be kind of like a rectangle, but on the top, it's going to be a little thinner than it is on the bottom. Now, what can I use to help me? You can use just about anything if you want to make straight lines. First of all, you can just, you know, eyeball it and like that. But if you really want to get straight lines, you can also, you know, get the help of a straight edge like a ruler or you know a book or something like that and so if you're having trouble getting straight lines which lighthouses got some straight lines on them they got some curved lines but if you want help with straight lines just get something with an edge on it and go like that and just you know now for the lens housing that's where the lens is kept you know it's like a it's like the light and all these prisms around it that focus the light into a beam. That's going to be up here. And we're just going to be able to put almost like a little square or rectangle right here. Okay, so you got this kind of rectangle that's a little tapered off. You got a line there. And you got the lens house, which is not quite a square, but more like a rectangle over here. Now for the cap, I don't know, the hat, what do you call it? I'll find out. We're going to make a little bit of a angle there. Beep, beep, beep. And I can curve that line. The curve of my hand is just right. And let's make a little triangle up here, okay? All right. Yeah, now you can get a ruler or you can just use your hand, okay? Now the next thing I'm going to do, there's a little bit of a ball up here. So I'm going to put a ball about that big. And on top of the ball, I'm going to put a little spike. Oh, And I think that's so all the little birdies don't just go sit on the ball all day and have a ball, you know? Anyway, I just got the shape of my Makapu Lighthouse. Now I'm going to start adding some details and lighthouses, yeah, they got a lot of details. So we're going to do our best here. Around the base, I am going to give it a little bit of a curve. You notice that when you're looking at a lighthouse dead on, that line is going to be nice and level. But as you look down towards the bottom and up towards the top, the lines curve just a little. Yeah, you see how I curve this top just a little, so slightly. And I curve this top just a little. That gives the viewer the impression they're looking straight on here, but looking down and looking up there. Now for the door on the Makapu Lighthouse, I'm going to put a little doorway. It's a little angled right there. Say you're just kind of flying along with the bird. You can see the lighthouse like that and the door right there. Now right over here, there's a little bit of a window. And again, we're using slightly curved lines on the top and the bottom. Just a little curve like that, telling the viewer that we're looking slightly down at that, looking dead on right there, and looking slightly up at the cap. All right, now for the walk around base, I'm gonna make just a little bit of a sphere shape. Just like a plate, you know? It's like you're looking at a plate sideways. And then above from that, I'm gonna make little poles for railings and I'm gonna make a little shape coming around like that just about like that okay and that's the railing that goes in front of the lens now for the lens you know where the light comes from I'm gonna put like a big this you know that's the light itself yeah and you can put some uh, prisms in there but you can do whatever you want you know for the shape in there here's what I'm doing now on top of that I'm gonna put some bars where the glass window panes are connected to and 
it seems like every lighthouse got different shapes of their lens room. You know, the Makapu lighthouse, it's got a couple of lines going this way. There. And then some lines that start coming down this way. You know, make them skinny on the sides, the distance between the gaps. And as they start facing you, they get a little bigger, a little farther apart, okay? Yeah. All right. And now that we've got our base there, we can start putting some bushes, little plants and things. You can start putting some poles that are around the base of the lighthouse. Okay. And then you can start getting into your detail, depending on how much details you want. There's also like three little windows right here. And in recent years, they've been closed up. Before, they used to be vents. They used to be partially open. Just like this used to have a little window in it. So maybe you might like to just put a little window. You might like to put a doorknob over there. You know, we're doing kind of a simplified version of the lighthouse because the actual lighthouse has got so much details, you know. But speaking of details, go ahead and have fun with the details. Putting some bars up here that holds the railing. Bing, bing. And you can put a couple other little lines here. And they even got a little railing up here. Bink. A little railing that's right above there that also has some little lines or bars there. Now go ahead and get some action in here like uh, bushes you know rocks whatever you might like to put you can put a horizon back there in fact if you're looking at the makapu lighthouse from this angle if you're flying up there with a bird or something you might see molokai back there island you know and in the sky you might see some clouds like that you can even put some birds because this is where the birds like to hang out, you know, in the sky. All right, so now that you got your lighthouse formed up and you got things generally the way you want it, you know, if you feel that you've made some lines too big, too small, in the wrong place, whatever, that's why we press softly in the beginning. Softly. Now I'm gonna get a little bigger pen, see? And I'm gonna go over the shapes. I'm gonna tighten them up. In other words, I'm gonna make them look a little more how I want them to look. So this is kind of just a base to put all your details on. I am gonna go ahead and make the mount in here. I'll make the base of the lighthouse. You notice that I'm not using all the lines that I've drawn. Yeah, some bushes, rocks, scriggles and smiggles. Okay, now I'm gonna go and trace the outlines of the lighthouse and make them just the way I want them with a bigger pen. All right. And there you have a Makapu lighthouse. <laughs> now go ahead and shade your lighthouse drawing and make it look any way you want. And don't forget your signature. 